Does Kamala Harris know what she's talking about? Hi, I'm Brian Lilly, political columnist for the Toronto Sun. I've seen all the polling. Yes, Canadians uh, want Kamala Harris to win the U U.S. presidential election. Doesn't matter who the Republican candidate is, Canadians tend to re prefer the Democrat, even though the Democrats are more protectionist, bad for Canada. But Harris is an interesting person. My friend Stu Brugier, who lives in Texas, works with Glenn Beck's program, has been doing this thing for years, since Harris became vice president, called Veep Thoughts. It's a takeoff on the old Saturday Night Live skit, Deep Thoughts with Jack Handy. It's Veep Thoughts with Kamala Harris, where he takes unaltered clips of her and plays them because nobody quite knows what she's saying. I was reminded of those when Harris made these statements the other day. She's talking to a football team and tells them they can be undefeated even if they don't win every game. And by doing that, and all that that requires, which is the hard work, the practice, working as a team, knowing that you will be undefeated even if you don't win every game, but no circumstance or event or moment will defeat your spirit. Now, I'm sure Harris was trying to make some deep philosophical thought about being undefeated in spirit or something. It still makes no sense, and neither do many of her comments, neither do many of her policies. You should have seen her talking about her economic policy, trying to explain it when she finally spoke to reporters the other day. It wasn't nice. Now we've got this front page story on the New York Times saying we're not going to talk policy in depth during this campaign. It's, it's not long enough. We'll just talk about it in broad strokes. Let me tell you what those broad strokes mean for Canada. More protectionism, more protectionism, more protectionism. And yes, more than Joe Biden, more than Donald Trump, more than Barack Obama. That's what we face if Kamala Harris wins. You may like it because you just want a Democrat in the White House, but will it be good for Canada's economy? Probably not. Let me know what you think. Drop a comment down below, share this on social media, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.